Okay, so nonetheless, <clears throat> it is pouring cats and dogs. Do you hear me? I said cats and dogs. So, um, actually, I'm gonna take. I'm going to Starbucks right now because I'm hungry. So, I might as well get me a little sandwich, and then I'm going to get me a frappuccino. Period. And actually, I might just get me an iced coffee from Starbucks. Today I wanted to take my kids to the museum. However, <laughs> however, I think I'm gonna go, but I don't think I'm gonna go. So it is 12 o'clock. I'm about to go get Amari from camp. And from there, I'm gonna tell my kids to get dressed. And I'm gonna go see if tickets are available. Because if they're not available, that means we can't go. Cause I was going to buy the tickets yesterday, but then I was like, it's supposed to rain. So I want to make sure, you know, it's inside anyway, but I think I might just go to the museum with them today. I'm feeling to take them to the museum. It's not too hot. It's not too cold. It's rainy. So I'm hoping everybody stayed home today so we can be in the museum by ourselves. Nonetheless, I am, I think that's all I'm doing today. I might just get some, probably some Chinese food tonight because my kids been wanting Chinese food. Might get some Chinese food for them tonight. Surprise them with that. And then from there, this weekend, me and hubby's gonna go check out a few stores to get Lala some stuff. He wants to bring her and I'm like, negative. How about I just leave both of y'all and go my damn self? Nah, I like hanging out with my hubs, with my baby. But um, it's fine. Um, yeah, Sunday we're definitely going to church. Um, Sunday we're definitely going to church. And I think hubby wants to take us for brunch after church. I'm going to find out from him. But that would be so nice if he can take us to brunch. The kids want to go to IHOP. Erica wants mozzarella sticks. 
she want my savella sticks like crazy but i'm yapping too much but nonetheless guys welcome back to the vlog you already know who it is it's your girl Gemma. Gems, okay. It's Gemma's Gems. You can follow me on all other platforms as Gemma Gems Work. Okay, you feel what I'm trying to say? Everything lifestyle, everything family thing, everything motivation, everything love. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Real life, real life. So anyway, guys, um, I'm about to grab my Starbucks, go get E, head back to the house, shower, all that good stuff do my hair and we about to be outside like we finna go outside i actually supposed to go to the library today i have to go to the library today yep so this afternoon i have to go to the library with alexander yep he has to change his book and we have to bring back the puzzles the puzzles are only supposed to be checked out for a week one week so yesterday made it a week and i didn't go yesterday yeah, we're going to the library today. I'm going to put the stuff in the car. But nonetheless, y'all go ahead and have a great Friday. And I'm going to check in back with y'all later. By the way, for those of you whose mouth is watering from that yummy, yummy, yummy fish that we cooked yesterday. Yeah. Uno should have did it. Mm-hmm. You should have been there. Mm-hmm. You should have been there, my sister. Hey, the fish was so good. <laughs> the fish was so good. The fish melted in my mouth. Ha. <laughs> Are you listening to me? I'm trying to tell you if you could smell the fish, oh, hey, your mouth of water, your mouth of your mouth of water. Anyway, that's for all my Africans. You know, I love you. I like cooked food. Yeah, my Ghanaians, <laughs> my Benins, <laughs> my Nigerians. <laughs> yeah, me love, you no. Know? Real love, big up love. Yeah, I'm you know? feel. But anyway, si vous jouez à faire de l'eau hier, il faut nous taper. Quand il poisson ça, ça t'a tapé pour vous. Senti bon, taste good, look good, yeah. Mm -hmm. We don't play with food. Anyway, I'm joking too much, guys. I'm in a, I'm in such a good mood. But anyway, talk to y'all later. Um, yes, I'm gonna have a small iced coffee. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have that sweet splash of milk, splash of cream. And I'm you have going... a cream and milk in it? Correct, a splash. So I would like the coffee to be dark. The iced coffee to be dark. Okay. Um, and I'm Do you going... want the classic syrup in it? Sorry. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do the turkey, bacon, cheddar, and egg white sandwich. And can I have that double toasted? Turkey, bacon, sandwich, and double toasted. Any other food? And one cake pop, please. What kind? Happy birthday. Birthday. Okay. That would be all. Thank you. All right, you can pull it up. All right, bye. I bought a cake pop for Amari, so my kids, when you're watching this, don't be mad. Don't be mad. So, anyway, thank you. Oh, no. Um, I do need a straw, sorry, so I can shake it, yeah. No problem, you're good. Thanks. Did I give you the cake pop? Yes. Okay. Thank you. So, <clears throat> I'm about to enjoy my Starbucks. I can just like imagine like a year ago, just a year ago, I was like, I wasn't bashing Starbucks, but I was just like, why the is it so expensive? Like, like all that, you know what I mean? And then my daughter 
is onto Starbucks. And then now, look at me. Listen, 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 Linda. Listen, listen, Linda. Listen, listen. It's all about branding, guys. It's branding, 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 branding. Sell the brand. Okay? Sell the brand. Not the product. The product gotta be good. But if you sell the brand, everything luxury. That's it. That's exactly what Starbucks is. Everything luxury. Ah, uh, you gotta pay for luxury. You gotta pay for luxury. And if you don't like this, go down the block to Dunkin' Donuts. But those who love Starbucks gonna go keep going to Starbucks. Point blank, period. Pay for luxury. know we back we back with the vlog i already told y'all this month that i'll potentially i'll be taking my kids to a museum today so that's what we're gonna do not technically a museum i'm not gonna reveal the location yet because the kids are in the car you know they nosy ah, they nosy so i did step out we're driving to our location is about 45 to 50 minutes out from where we live so your girl packed some water some snacks a few pieces of candy and we hit the road it is actually about 3 45 the location close is at six the last admission is at five so i'm thinking we only need like an hour and a half anyway we don't need more than an hour and a half the weather is kind of still funky the sun did come out Everything is dry. I'm going to double check the weather again once I um, reach, which is kind of dumb, but I'm going to check the weather because it's supposed to start raining again at 4 o'clock. Weather permitting, we will have a great time. If it starts to rain, it's not the end of the world. At least we came out, we get one for a drive. After that, we're going to get them something to eat. But anyway, you already know your girl can chat your head off. But we jam into some R&B old school. You already know. And we driving we enjoying this friday so make sure you enjoy this friday but nonetheless if you ain't got nothing to do let's go let's go girl i said let's go we out And where did you learn that from? School. School is good then. <laughs> huh? Yeah, right? I've never, I don't think I've ever heard that word in my life. <laughs> oh, you just wasn't listening. Oh my god. This is so good. This is crazy. As the day comes, 
She's like, We're gonna start the drive through the drive through adventure. The weather looks like it's about to start pouring, but it's a beautiful day actually because it's not too hot and it's not too and it's not raining and stuff like that. So enter park at own risk. <laughs> So guys, it's pouring. Yeah, it's pouring. No, it just stop. No, it didn't. We went under the tree. <laughs> it's pouring, guys. So we're gonna see what we can see, and then. Is it supposed to be hot? You gotta see the zebras. Yeah. I want to see the tipatonka dog. <laughs> but the, <laughs> there's one right here too. You psycho. Oh, my God. I'm already the size, huh? Let's go under this tree, so. Kid, it's a house. Yeah. What the? Put a mountain on that for? Because you, you, I'm under the tree so we can see. You see look y'all light green. Where? See it over here on this side. On the other side. You see it? He's staring at us. He's trying to figure out why the hell is this water here. He's like, what are you No. Why would you want to throw the food? You don't even need to feed it. No, you open it. Then don't. You, then yeah. you chuck it. Then you chuck it at the you got bad aim, so you're not even gonna get it over the fence. Yes, I am. I can throw the football pretty far. I did it. it. E, you see it? The first one. Oh, it's kicking a little bit. First okay, I'm gonna call the first grandma, the grandma that. All right, guys, Alexander, I don't want to hear about it. You want to get down and go see the answer, Zebra? Yeah, 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 Look 
Look at the bit. Look at the zebra. The sound Try. I don't know how you're gonna give it to them. Oh, this side. Maybe right here you gotta give put it yeah, put the cup, just put the cup in there like that. Mommy, I'm you do it. <laughs> give me. Oh, he's coming. <laughs> just put it at the door. Just put it like that. Give me. <laughs> Take the top off. I'm scared. <laughs> snack from you. That horsey will eat you up. <laughs> Alright guys, hey, hey, hey. It's another day. Yesterday we had a blast. Okay, we had such a great time. The rain held up. So the kids and I had a good Saturday. That was today's date. Alright, you ready? Your voice is July 15. Um, I'm actually heading out now. We're going to the mall. Me, Alexander, baby Lala, and hubby because we're going to go do a little, 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 little shopping for Lala. If anything she needs, her book bag and about two or three pairs of shoes for school. You guys all know that. She started school this week. So, um, um, she will be excited. So, I am just going to be getting a few things for her. So, we're going to go see what we can get from her. We're really just, I just want to go to H&M, Target, and Burlington or Marshall. She did not want to go for her shoes and... I'm not, for, I'm not going crazy, I'm not going overboard, so nonetheless, let's go!
I specifically said that I'm not bringing no kids. 
your boy wanted to bring the kids. And now he's in the store yelling like a madman. A madman. It's actually 1.45 and it's Sunday the 16th. Yesterday, I stepped out with hubby real quick. Um, my two kids, Alexander and Lala, and that was an epic fail. They pissed me off so bad. I just left everything that I'm doing and I went home. You know I'm gonna keep it real with y'all, so. Yeah, they pissed me off, okay? That was not it. Moms know what's up. When you wanna get something done, we ain't taking the kids with us. We not taking the kids with us. No, we said, babe, let's leave the kids. We're not taking them. Let's go. Nah, just take them. I was gonna want everything in the mall. He's walking into stores, doing everything he's not supposed to be doing. I'm like, what is going on? These kids must be bump they had this morning. Lala's flying down the mall. He can't catch up. It was just an epic thing. Anyway, today is Sunday. Um, I'm dropping a reset video tonight. Super excited about that. My goal is really and truly to 
keep it up. Sunday resets are something that's really, really dear to my heart. They're really important to me. I feel like as a mom, you know, as a mom specifically, Sunday resets are truly, truly, truly important. Um, you know, laundry, you know, food, making sure there's stuff in the house for the kids to eat. Um, just re upping on everything, cleaning the bathroom, all that, you know. When I was a kid, I used to, have to do that every every Saturday. But anyway, I um did not go to church this morning. It was raining cats and dogs. Didn't go to church. Kind of feel bad about that. There is a service at 5:30 anyway. I might just go to that by myself. Because Lord knows I just need a minute for myself. I just need a minute to myself. So I'm heading to Sam's Club to grab a few things. Yep, we're done. And I got wet in the rain. I got wet in the rain. Sweat and wet at the same time. It started pouring. And now that I'm done packing up the stuff in the car, the rain won't stop. I'm done. I'm done. So these are the moments when you gotta do what you gotta do. You just gotta do what you gotta do. You know what I mean? So my husband's about to call me and tell me, yep, 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 yep. Cause I just spent $150 in Sam's Club. Easy. So my next stop is gonna be Walmart and then Dollar Tree. And then we're going home. Walmart and then Dollar Tree. I'm happy because I'm done with laundry, so I'm just gonna go home, clean my bathroom. Once I'm done cleaning the bathroom, um, bathroom my floors, that will all be in my Sunday reset video. I'm gonna go home and take a shower. Guys, this morning I booked a hair appointment. The girl's gonna get her hair braided this week. I'm not a picky person. I found a girl that's in my area. She is gonna do some knotless braids for me. I'm gonna do them really, really big. It's not gonna be no small, maybe like 20, 25 braids max. But I'm gonna cut my hair. I'm gonna cut it down really, really, really low. I don't have no activities coming up. My daughter's birthday is next. And I might get the same girl to do my daughter's hair. Done. Um, she's very feasible. I don't really know. I'm not too sure how, you know, what it's gonna look like, you know, if it's me, if she just starting, but you know, in life you have to give people a chance. And you know, that's it. I like to give people chances, that's just it. So I'm gonna perm my hair. I really just wanna put a rinse in my hair. 
but I'm a permit because I want these to be. I don't know if it's gonna be slick. It's not gonna be slick the way I want it to be. So I want to cut my hair too, though. So I'm a permit, and then I'm going to cut it and then get it done. I'm gonna cut it. I'm not gonna go really, really low, but like we're gonna take it out. Like you see, my I cut it just the other day. And so we're probably gonna take it up to like right here. We're gonna get rid of the like crap. I wanna say that's like two inches. So I'm gonna cut up like two inches, two to three inches, and get it braided. Today, you guys, hopefully you guys watch my Sunday reset because maybe we finished with Sunday reset and I'm turning my curtain today in my room. I want to see how they look if they look and I'm taking them down. We're going with white. I think I'm going to do white for summer and spring. And in the winter time, I'm going to go black. Because you guys know my room is purple, purple and black. And then once my curtains is up, I'm going to go ahead and order the dressers. That's going to be the next project for my bedroom. Um, I'm contemplating on taking Lala's crib out of my room. But at the same time, she's starting school. So I'm hoping by September, she sleeps in her own bed. So if I can get her to sleep in her own bed, then I will not be able to get the vanity that I want. I want a little makeup vanity for my room and a chair. I will not be able to do that because her crib taking up the space for my stuff. So we're going to Walmart and I'll talk to you guys later because I feel like I got too much. So, um, let's go. I'm all wet. See that? That's the rain. Yo, let me tell you something. As soon as my daughter see me pick up the camera, Dad, she is there. So I just got home, as you can see, and I put the stuff away from Sam's Club already. And I'm go through this stuff before I go upstairs and clean my bathroom and finish up my Sunday reset. I bought these from Target on Amazon. And these are curtains or window trees or whatever you want to call them. So there's four in this and I think I paid 28 or something like that. I think I'm gonna love this material. Because I wanted the sheer look, as you can see. I wanted the sheer look, so it's four panels that come in this one pack. So, um, when hubby comes, I'm gonna go ahead and get him to put this up today in my room. And then I also bought this one. This is two panels, and this is twenty four dollars. I think I'm gonna send this back. Because we already know summer is only literally four months. We're already in July. Um, it's the same thing, but it's just two. Yeah, we're sending this one back. This one's going back. So this is going back. This is two panels. And the size that I bought was 102. Is that right? I think I bought 108. 108. Might be a little bit too long, but we're gonna work it out. And then yesterday, you know, we went to Target. So we bought some. We bought these leggings for Lala. Them up for outfits. These are five dollars. Y'all already know the cat and jack hat. Cat and jack. Wear it and then bring it back if you have your receipt. So we did that. Scan the receipt, send it to your email. That's what I did. And some shirts. She's actually a 3T, but we got 4T because. Oh, why did I pick up 5T? Guys, this is going to be a dress on her. That was a mistake. It was supposed to be 4T or 3T. So some cute leggings. Um, I 
am contemplating her going in a skirt or shorts. It's summertime, yes, but you know, they're kids and they fall, they scrape their legs. And we don't want that. So, I think she's just gonna go with leggings. Her dad tried to pick up some jeans for her. I said, uh huh. We're not doing that. We're not doing that because the jeans. You know, it gets uncomfortable. She's not fully potty trained yet. She started with the potty training. She gotta take her hands down. You know, us moms are overthinkers. Um, so there we have it. And we got her a new sweater. Just, you know, to have in her book bag just in case she gets a little cold and they still have to go outside. So they, 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 they're, they are set. So that's one set, two sets, three sets. Yes, mommy. So, I think I was thinking to do white with this one. What happened? Four sets. And then we have the orange. So that's pretty much it for that. And then we went to Dollar Tree. Let me come closer with this one because Dollar Tree had me like, okay, okay. So I got these for Lala. Am I? Am I? <laughs> I got these for Lala. So she's getting to a Play-Doh type thing. This is a little phone for her because her phone is broken for her little house thing. So. It actually rings. Hey, hello. Hello, Lala. Lala. Oh, what? When you gonna sleep in your own bed? Oh, what? I said, when you gonna sleep in your own bed and get out of my room? <laughs> and then this, I got her. This is for the... One second. This is like a Play-Doh thing that she can... Um, one second, mommy. She is so dirty. So she can... You know what is it called? Trace or yeah, and then she can roll her play-doh out and stuff. And then this is to to cut and shape her play-doh. This thing is <laughs> I'm cracking up. Look at that. Listen, okay, Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. Okay, I see you. I see you, Dollar Tree. You're getting these, you can't be getting these kids right. <laughs> it's fine, it's hers. And then I got her some of those. So these came in a pack for $1.25. Mm -hmm. And I'm pretty sure everything is gonna be done by the end of today. I'm probably not even gonna find anything. Okay, move ballots, bye. Go to your sister. So anyway, I went to Dollar Tree today and I was like, ah! picking up some stuff. This is where I get my garbage bags from. For my house the carmax this is what i use Com comet comet uh lavender i use this for the bathroom sometimes i clean the toilet with it but sometimes i don't i got a foot scrub from dollar tree and i was like i need a foot scrub okay it comes Mom, with your brother's right there. Get him to help you. All right, so this is what it comes with. Okay. And I'm thinking this is supposed to... Okay, 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 Dollar Tree. All right, let me get this right real quick. All right. So scrub them feet, ladies. Scrub them feet. 
Cause baby, I was feeling away yesterday. When I looked at my feet, I was like, oh no, baby. <laughs> oh no, baby. And let me say something. These products are expensive. They're not cheap. Okay? And you can't keep them for a long time either. You cannot keep foot scrub things. I know my mom keep them shits for like 10 years. Like... Literally, baby, they got to go. Dollar Tree, like I was saying, and I got me a clear liner. I always get my liners from Dollar Tree. As soon as I wash the, sh the mats and the no. curtain, we change the liner. Um, I usually buy two, three of those because I no. like to. I like to keep them because I like to change my showers like uh, almost every two weeks or every week sometimes, depending if it smells if it's smelling musty. Um. So then, this is what I found in Dollar Tree. Guys, can you see that? Hydraulic acid serum. And I was like, skincare? Yeah, in Dollar Tree. I mean, let's try it out. Okay, and then I have the moisturizer as well. So you put this on first, and then you put this on. I'm gonna try it out. Because products are so expensive. There's no really smell to it. And yeah, we're gonna try those out. This is a deep pour of cleanse, and this is a deep cleansing. Okay, helps remove oil and dirt, that's one. And this one helps clear acne and blemishes. So we're gonna try those out. I'm gonna try those out. Okay. Um, we also got an exfoliator. We know that exfoliating your skin is very, very important. I didn't learn that until like I was in my early 30s. Not to say that I'm that old, but listen, I wasn't on skincare. I couldn't afford to get skincare. Uh, Vaseline and um, yeah, lotion. That was it. So we are, I, as I've gotten older and started focusing more on, you know, self-care and stuff, we, you know, find out little things that will give us the tricks and help us. So that's an exfoliator. I'm going to try that out. Um, this is a cuticle remover. Can you see it? It's a cuticle remover. So we're about to see what's really, really, really good with that. Okay. Um, if you know, you know, cuticles is very a, a part of self-care. So we got that. Um, I got this because I want to paint my toenails and sometimes it'd be like going one on top of the other. So we got this so we can do our nails, la la's nails, the girl's nails. And guys, Dollar Tree. Um, excuse me, put that down. Dollar Tree. I was like, what? Dollar Tree is fake lit. And today I decided to splurge a little bit on myself. So what I did was, look at that. I'm excited to use this, actually, to be honest. I'm excited to use it. All right, so we gotta get some batteries in there. We got some batteries upstairs. <gasps> Guys, we finna be washing our face. Dollar Tree. So I got another extra brush because my daughter, uh, yeah, improvise ladies. So I got one for me and one for Erica. So I'm gonna put an E on here and then I'll put a G on this one so that, you know, she can use it and I can use it until, um, and see if she really wants it. But she wants to get into skincare too. So this is the best way. I feel like you spend less, try out, different products of course products are very expensive you know start your routine see what's up see how it feels and you splurge from there okay you splurge from there but anyway that's my little dollar tree haul um make sure you guys tune in leave a comment down below because you would have already seen my skin sunday reset video and yeah, I'm excited. I forgot to get a little basket stuff to put in the bathroom and put these stuff in there. But we lit. We lit. We lit. But I'm going to see you guys in a little bit. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. 
Wow. So, I'm going to talk to you guys in a little bit. Uh, I think I'm done for today. I don't think I'm doing anything else for today. Oh, yeah, I'm going to put up the windows. The window treatment. Um, that might be in the Sunday reset video, actually. Either or. We'll see. We shall see. Anyway, probably not. Um, I'm going to talk to you guys in a little bit later. Bye. All right, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. It's officially Monday. I'm taking out Lala's hair. Say hi, Mommy. Hi. Hi. Yep, yeah, so we are taking out Lala's hair. I'm going to wash it and braid it today. I'm going to do a simple style. I ain't going to go too crazy because, you know, she's not with the it. <laughs> she's not with it. So it's Monday, guys. Comment down below. Let me know how you enjoyed the Sunday reset. Um, I just feel like it was a little bit too long, uh, maybe a little bit too dragged out. But, you know... We just, you know, we gonna, we, we working through the kinks. So we're going to find out what works for us, what don't work for us, what makes sense, what don't make sense. So I'm excited to do next week's Sunday Reset. I'm super excited about that. But I'm going to take out a few braids that's left. We're going to wash her hair. I'm going to go pick up Amari from school. Because y'all know he has camp. And Lala has um, her meet and greet with her teacher tomorrow at 1 o'clock. So we're gonna get ready for that and yeah it's monday um i'm definitely going to the library with the kids today because they got to bring back the puzzles they got to bring back the books and whatnot so we will be productive today Later. Oh my god, put that back in there.
What are you doing home today? I have my kid to school. My daughter to school. Okay. Anyway, guys, it's so hot. <laughs> I could not get out of the bed this morning. Could not. Anyway, I'm gonna see you guys and I'll give you guys an update on how everything goes with Lala's orientation. Perfect, there she is. So that's the effect. I'm sure a big enough. We have to have a formula. crazy hectic day your girl is not 100 percent but i'm pushing through um my husband's calling me so let me answer anyway guys so welcome back to the vlog once again today is monday the 18th or well, the 19th one of them what's today today is the 18th and it's not Monday, it's Tuesday. I'm so old in the place, guys. Um, so I took Lala to her orientation today. We met with her teacher. Mm -hmm. I don't know, we'll see. I'll give her the benefit of the doubt, but I know we're going to bump heads. That's number one. Um, not speaking that into existence, but listen, this is not my first go around. But we're gonna stick it out and see how it goes. Um, and then, what else did I do? You guys saw my mom's with an ass um, picking the beans. Um, they actually were outside in the garden. I wish I could have showed you guys that, but I forgot. I, I I forgot, number one, to go out and show you guys the garden, but I've showed you guys a garden on my vlog before. That's what Lala is always watering when she's outside with Kai Kai. Um, and they cook with the beans today. The food was so... Please don't say that, bro. I'm so sorry. The food was so good. What the hell? guys freaking lady almost smacked my whole car off like if I didn't swerve it would have been over I would have been in a car accident anyway um it started pouring or it started raining like crazy so I ended up going home taking all our home putting her down for a nap she was just crying when we left the school she did not want to leave she wanted to stay she wanted to play we were not in her classroom so it was another teacher's classroom and lala just taught she just turned it upside down okay she pulled everything out my baby was just so excited and yeah nobody can control her so tomorrow's another day oh i'm tired I really, really need to be in bed right now. I should not be outside driving. But anyway, I'm going to Walmart real quick. Then I'm running to Sam's Club. And then I'm going to Burlington. Yes, I'm going to Burlington. Um, so we're going to do those three things. And then we're going to head back. Head back home. So let's go. <laughs> Guys, I reached to Sam's Club. Um, we just left Walmart. So we're gonna go in here real quick, pick up our five items, and leave. Okay? That's why it's important for you to check what you need before you 
come out because I was just here two days ago. Ah, so let's go. All right, guys. So whew, clearly, I'm in Burlington. I'm in exchange for these shoes. Aren't they cute? And found Lala a little book bag that she can rock with for the first couple of weeks of school until I get her fully settled in. Tomorrow she's going in for three hours. And then Thursday, three hours. And then from there, I already told the teacher it's summertime. She'll be coming like, you know, half a day. And they say that's fine, but starting September, you know, she'll be going full-time schedule. So, um, I ran into Big Y real quick. So now I'm gonna head home. And um, I think I'm done for today. So I'll catch up back with you guys once I get home. Hopefully I get to do a haul because I always forget to do a haul. I just be ready to put everything away. I'm still wiping down my stuff. It's just a headache. But yeah, let's see. All right, guys. So we got some popcorn, watermelon. Put that up in the house. Some yogurt. My mom asked for that. She's going to do DIY. Some bread. Bread. Get some hangers. Bananas, avocado, garlic bread for hubby, cheese for Alex, fruits, baby for the kids, croissant soup, and my seasoning is done, so complete seasoning. So, I also picked up this little mirror here for in front of our little closet there, so I was excited about that. <laughs> What you got? A backpack! Yay! For a backpack for you, guys. Look at the wall. Oh my god. Gotta come on, Miss Okay, you got you some all uh, crops. Wait, what is it? What is it, Grandma? Shall she put the bottom there? The new grill. You like it? Yes, Erica. Uh, let me see. Ooh, let me see. Is it pretty? It's pretty for you. Yay! There she is, Jeez. You ready to go to school? She's ready. Say bye. Bye. See you guys in a little bit.